that this could end okay. You know what I mean? Like all the, you're starting to think this is bad. This is bad. Yeah. Because you see a gun. It doesn't matter that it's Not blue really. or yeah. that it's gonna shoot paint or that we're all going home today. It's still this sucks. Is a different. Are we starting over again? This oh, stay back. Stay back. Give me your walk. For for critical areas of the body, we have the head, we have the thoracic cavity, and we have the lateral pelvis. Oh, my arm. Step back. Situation. How far is the bad guy likely to be from? Well, let's think about context here. If a guy is mugging me, is he going to do it from across the roof? He's going to get close, isn't he? I don't know how close. I'm not even going to bright line that because I don't like bright line distances. But what I will say is he's going to get close enough, common sense tells me, to speak to me. And he's probably going to get close enough to speak to me where someone close by might not overhear. Um, you're, everybody's familiar with the T-zone, right? Well, the T-zone is technically incorrect. Technically. Medically speaking, it is wrong because it focuses on the eyes as the top of the T. It doesn't do that because there's necessarily really critical stuff behind the eyes because there's still brain matter behind the eye. But it's targeting the eyes for ease of penetration into the body. It's not targeting it because that's the most important place to shoot. From here down and here, I have less resistance offered by the skull full of, for a bullet to penetrate. That doesn't necessarily mean it's the best place to put the bullet. So outside of the head, we have the torso. Um, this is where people commonly train to shoot because it's the greatest margin of error. If I'm taking 45 soldiers or 45 police cadets or 45 citizens off the street to teach them how to shoot, and I only have a short period of time which to teach them how to be proficient, I want to give them the best chance of success. So I'm going to give them the chest. Unfortunately, it does, without context, again, we come back to context, give people a false sense of effectiveness. Does it not? Absolutely. Just because I can get someone to hit the body and they hit it pretty well, are they necessarily understanding what's going on? Why we shoot there? Uh, some people preach center mass, center mass, center mass, center mass, center mass, and they actually say this is center mass. Well, we just talked about that. Center mass is the center of the target I select or that's offered to me. In the best case scenario, your bad guy is going to be square to you. But is that always going to be the case? I only need an eye and a hand to hurt somebody. I can get behind a wall, put my arm right down the wall, and just use my leading eye to aim the gun. And that's all you're going to get. So where do you shoot me then? Do you have that high thoracic cavity? Do you have that center mass? No, you have an eye and a hand and a gun. And maybe some shoulder. Maybe a little bit of chest. That's it. That's kind of like worst case scenario. Inside the chest, we have the hearts and the lungs. Lungs are critical for life function, but not immediately critical. You can take a bullet through the lung and still fight. Heart is center of the chest, two-thirds of it's above the nipple line. Roughly center of the chest, left-leaning. Um, it's not here. Everybody say, put their hand on their heart. I always did this. People stared at me like I was stupid. This is where it's at. I understood that as a child because I happened upon an anatomy book and flipped through it. And I learned, shocked the hell out of me. I learned the heart wasn't shaped like this. I was like, oh, my God, I've been lied to. I was a kid. Like, my whole world was destroyed. Was 20 percent of his blood, everybody has to lose at least 20 percent of their blood to begin to experience CNS failure. How long with a heart shot does that take? Four seconds or more, depending on the size of the hole in the heart. How many final actions can I have in four seconds? A lot. Four seconds is a long fucking time. How many rounds do you think you can fire a second? Um, <clears throat> from a draw? No, just if the, I put the gun in your hand right now and ran a shot timer, how many rounds do you think you'd get off in a second? I'd probably say four or five. Four or five. Um, I don't, and I don't want to quote this because I don't know where the data came from, but it's one of those things that somebody told me and I verified it myself just on a shot timer. They say that the average person can pull the trigger four times a second on a single action handgun. A trained individual can get it five. A experienced and trained individual can get it six. And I would, I would say that's pretty accurate. Under no stress at all, just range stress, four rounds a second. If I've got four seconds, how many rounds is that? And that's a lot of chances for them to hurt you. All right, so what happened? Tell me, uh, tell me what you had. Tell me what you saw. The guy came out. No weapons or anything. Asked for change. I mean, there was no reason for me to yeah, yeah. Like, pull out a gun. Mm -hmm. So I said, I don't have any gun, you know, I don't have any change. Then he pulled out a knife. And I mean, he was already within the reach. 
Yeah. So I think if you wanted to, you could have cut me already. So your reaction was pretty quick uh, as far as the first shot. No, that was fast. That was really fast. But, Although but, you did game but, it a little bit. I. But but, but the. Yeah, well, that's why I asked for change first, because you, as soon as I got up, you reached for the weapon. Yeah, I mean, that was like, so, when I saw you, that was like my, you know, reactions, like, fuck, I gotta get a gun. But then, you know, now that I'm thinking about it, like, first of all, my first shot was shit, because it was just one-handed, you know? Yeah. I just your, pulled it was out. a good from-the-hip shot. Though. Your first shot hit me right here. It, yeah. gave, it gave you time to get distance. The weapon did malfunction on you. So you had to reload, which you got distance to reload. Remember when we talked yeah. when we talked about getting movement, yeah. constant movement. The only time we want to stand still is if we need that really stable uh, platform to get really accurate precision fire. The rest of the time we want to be moving because it makes it harder for him to hurt us. Mm -hmm. So I didn't have enough time to even think about what was coming. Mm -hmm. And I saw. Well, you shouldn't have been thinking about what was coming anyway because it's, it's right. But you but you're saying you're going like, to you're going to game it a little bit. Um, well, no, even like like yeah. in that situation, yeah. where I'm going to friend's house. Yeah, I'm scanning anyway. Yeah, it's gonna set you off. So you know whether it's a dog, bush, whatever, I'm still gonna take note of mental note of it and continue yeah. on. So when he came out and I saw the knife and I heard white boy. I mean, that's I just drew and fired. I figured there's no point in giving you him saw a weapon. Yeah. Yeah, obviously. What did he have a knife? Yeah. Obviously, the one in your hand. Yeah. Um, I thought for sure I was gonna be able to reach you by the time you got that gun out because like you were How really loose and that. this is important the the fabled tooler drill the 21 foot rule from the time you came around the corner with the knife to the time he shot you how far were you from him when he saw you if you had to guess uh from probably right where he's standing now to that corner so 10 feet maybe i would say eight to ten feet from the time that he actually recognized the weapon and right. drew and fired he had eight, ten feet of distance. I yeah. didn't really ask what his intentions were. I just said, hey, stay back, stay back. When did you see a weapon? He, did you he see a weapon? produced what appeared to be a knife. Okay. And that was when I fired the first two shots while I was kind of trying to make my egress, and that was my... Now, why did you shoot? Because he had a knife, and he was not stopping. Okay. That's, that's articulation right there. That's yeah. factual articulation. He had a knife, he was coming at you, and he wasn't stopping. Correct. That's, that's what you need. Now, you put him down, then what happened? Um, I... I tried to create some space. Mm -hmm. um, after I created some space, he got back up, and I fired two more rounds. Now head. he got up. Why'd you shoot him again? Because he was still coming at you. Still, still presented a threat in it's, my it's mind. It's articulation. I'll, I'm yeah. not. I'm not. No, no, no don't, I got you. I did, I'm looking for articulation. Yeah. I want. Yeah. If this ever happens in real life, I want you to be able to articulate why you use force. Absolutely. That's the important part. Yeah. I mean, awesome. in my mind, he still presented a threat. Definitely. I would totally agree. 100 percent of the time. As I didn't. See him drop the knife or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. No, it's really good. Good job. Well, awesome. <clears throat> Whoa! Whoa! No. Back up! Back up! Whoa! No! Oh. Okay, okay, man. Stay down! Drop the knife! I'm calling the police. Stay on the ground. Now. What? Back up, man. Now. Back up. Back up. Uh, Stay down. Uh, Stay down. Uh, Throw the knife away, man. Throw the knife away. Uh, hey, what's up? Get a dog? Get a buck? Nope. Hey. Hey. Down! <laughs> Bitch! Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, you got a dollar? No, man. What about the time? You got the time? No, no, not tonight, buddy. No time? Nope, not tonight. Come on, man. No, I'm good. Oh, well, how about, how about some, you don't have any money whatsoever? No, man. Take her easy. You don't got a wall you on? You want to step back? Let me see your wall. I'm armed. Step back. Don't move. I'm armed. Don't move.
Jimmy, what? Get Jimmy back. Mike. Get back. All right, count the knife. All right, all right, all right. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I, I got nothing bad to say. No,